Podcast. This is Madeline Frankie and Griffin Radke with this week's nightly news. Inspiration opens tonight, so come out and support the theater department. This is the seniors' last Dominican performance, and they are getting ready to say goodbye. The show features songs by Skrillex, Skylar Gray, Adele, Nicki Minaj, and more. The show runs through Saturday night. Here's Anne Fellow with cast members now. Thanks, Maddie. I'm here with Jason Brown, who's a big part of Inspirations this year. So, Jason, can you explain what Inspirations is about? Well, Inspirations is a uh, dance revenue. Um, really, like, from what I heard, it was made after a couple years ago. Kids in the musical wanted to do something else because there was this long period of time that weren't doing anything. I did Inspiration for my tourist time last year. It was a really fun, exciting time. That's awesome. That's really cool. Um, so do you think, I hear there's a lot of variety this year. Do you think that's good or bad? Uh, yeah, I, I do. Last year I was kind of, there were a few songs I was kind of like, hey, do I feel it? I, I wasn't in it, but they showed me a lot of different numbers. Like, there were a few different songs that I would not have thought I would have done last year. Like, okay, that's awesome. Thanks, Jason. I'm here with Juan from Inspirations. Juan, are you excited for the show? Oh, yeah. Can you give us a little information about it? Like, what should people look forward to? They should look for the beauty of the dances, the, the choreography, the the costumes, the, just everything in general. Wow, it sounds like a really cool show. Yeah. Thanks, Juan. <laughs> Back to you, Maddie. Thanks, Dan. Tomorrow is Dominican's first ever multicultural day. Students will participate in different activities such as cooking and dancing to enrich their knowledge and appreciation for other cultures. Check out ne next week's broadcast to hear how it went. Seniors are leaving for the Dells on Sunday for, for our senior trip. Here's a word from some seniors now. Thanks, Maddie. I'm here with Caitlin Flores, who's attending senior trip this Sunday. Are you excited, Caitlin? I'm really excited. Um, this is our last chance for all of us to be together and just like bond and have fun, go swimming, play laser tag, and I'm I'm I'm, I'm really excited actually. I'm really excited too. Thanks, Caitlin. No problem. Right. I'm here with Adam Worth, who's also attending the senior trip. Adam, are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. Uh, I've heard a lot about it. And uh, it's something to look forward to. Good end of the year. Alright, thanks Adam. Thanks, Dan. Prom was last Friday and all students who attended certainly dressed to impress. A big thank you to the Junior Prom Committee for all their hard work. Also, congratulations to Max Pignati and Elizabeth Mueller, who are crowned this year's Prom King and Queen. Let's go to Anne's fellow with a sports update. Thanks, Maddie. This week, Tuesday, our boys' baseball lost 0-7 to to Lake Country Lutheran. Tonight, we will be playing Lake Country Lutheran again at 4.30. Come support our boys and get them back into full swing. Softball is doing great and won on Tuesday 9-2 against Lake Country Lutheran, with senior JoJo Wickland pitching seven innings and winning the game. Come support our Lady Knights on Friday at 4.30 against Martin Luther. Dominican girls soccer is looking up with a hard fought win against Lake Country Lutheran, 1-0 with freshman Mary Mansker leading the team with the goal. Come cheer our girls on this Friday at E-Line against Wayland Academy at 4.30. Back to you, Maddie. And for your fun fact of the week, the yearbook is officially done and being printed. This is Madeline Frankie and Griffin Redke reporting not live from Dominican High School. Till next week, DHS. <laughs>